Mastering idiomatic expressions for introducing ideas in formal writing. Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today, we're going to dive into a fascinating subject within the realm of advanced English vocabulary and idiomatic expressions. Specifically, we're focusing on idiomatic expressions for introducing ideas in formal writing. Yes, you heard it right. Even in formal contexts, idiomatic expressions can make your writing richer and more engaging. So, let's get started. You might be wondering, aren't idiomatic expressions usually informal? Well, the answer is both yes and no. While idiomatic expressions are commonly used in informal communication, some are perfectly acceptable and even advantageous in formal writing. Using idioms in formal writing can make your work more nuanced, more persuasive, and more impactful. However, the key is to choose idioms that are universally understood and that fit the tone of your writing. Let's delve into some idiomatic expressions specifically used for introducing new ideas. Open a can of worms. This idiom is generally used to signify that discussing or bringing up an issue will lead to further complications. In formal writing, this expression can effectively hint at the complexity of the topic you're about to explore. Example. Discussing healthcare reform inevitably opens a can of worms, from questions of cost to ethical considerations. Tip of the iceberg. This idiom suggests that you're only seeing or discussing a small, visible part of a much larger issue. It's a compelling way to introduce a complex topic that has layers to explore. Example. The current legislation is merely the tip of the iceberg when it comes to environmental protection. The elephant in the room. Use this when you want to address an obvious problem or issue that everyone's ignoring. It helps to create a sense of urgency or importance about the subject you're introducing. Example, the elephant in the room is the lack of affordable housing, a subject which policymakers seem reluctant to tackle. It's important to note that idiomatic expressions should be used sparingly and judiciously in formal writing. Here are some best practices. 1. Understand the context. Make sure you fully understand the idiom and that it fits within the context of your writing. 2. Universal understanding. Choose idioms that are widely understood, avoiding expressions that are too localized or colloquial. 3. Don't overuse. Idioms can be powerful, but using too many can make your writing feel cluttered and less formal. So there we have it. Folks, incorporating idiomatic expressions into your formal writing can introduce new ideas in a captivating and nuanced manner. Just remember to use them sparingly and appropriately for the best effect. I hope this video has been enlightening and will help you elevate your formal writing skills. Until next time, happy writing!